Hello, and welcome to Grug Gaming, and welcome back to our Let's Play of Ultima 7 Part 2, The Serpent Isle. We are here on the Silver Seed expansion, working our way towards Limdal, uh, and we were in this corridor when we left off, and I found out that one of these doors should just open for us. So we're going to continue on. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. If you've been around, thanks for watching. Let's see what happens. So, in theory... What I saw said, if you just walk up to one of these doors, it should open. Oh, got it. <laughs> there was no... There really was no trick to this. We just need to let the team do their thing. That should be easy enough. I don't know where that one's going. Come on, team. You got this. Oh no, is this an infinite spawning situation? I hope not. I hope that as we walk around this area, they don't spawn back in. Did that guy get up or spawn in? I couldn't tell. I don't think they're actually dying. There's more up top, apparently, maybe? I don't know, but let's flip these switches while we're here. Or let's, uh, not flip these switches. Finish this last one off. There we go. Now we can go back to normal movement. Is this the room where it's every other switch? Let's find out. So if we flick all the switches... Oh, there's more up here. Yes, this is one of those spawning situations. To bring up something someone else mentioned earlier in a comment... You know, one of the worst things in Ultima is the fact that these monsters respawn when we walk in back into the area in the same map. Let's see if we have to do them all or if there's a trick to it here. Because again, that lady said that we had to flick them in a specific order. Let's just try them all. And see if there actually is a trick to this. Mm -hmm. One more over here. All right, so what we're going to do, we've got them all flipped. We're going to do a quick save. Assault and Goblin Town. Hey, it's just, yeah, flick them all. Okay. Here we go. Save game. Getting rich. I hope we're getting rich. The Avatar survived.
Well, I just want to see if our reveal spell works. Okay. So, let's load our game. Goodbye. Okay. So, we have a monster up there that we have to fight. And everything went horribly wrong when we walked in. So what I'm going to do here is we're going to try and rush him and see if we all die or not on the rush. I'm really worried about Brayden. Boyden. Alright, so here we go. Here's hoping. If we just run. Okay, everyone dies. Just. So I wonder. Just the avatar seems to be surviving this. So I'm going to try something. Shimino. Leave. No. Okay, bye. Um. I'm hoping that he'll just be here when I come back, is what I'm hoping. What I want to do is, where's that sword? Put that here. I want YOLO. I want a couple potions. Okay. So that was Shimino. YOLO. Uh, leave. Uh, no. Hold on to him. Bye. Broyden. Boyden. Leave. No. Buy. And then to pray, leave. No. Buy. Now we'll do a save. We'll let's call this alone. All alone. Uh, all alone? Alone. Okay. So now let's give this a shot. No. Stay down here, te team. I hope when I come back, they're all there. All right. Nope. Almost had it. Almost had it. All right. We're almost there. Okay. Good. 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 All right. So, first things first. Let's heal ourselves back up so we don't die. Okay. And then we'll wait for him to go invisible. But okay. Let's equip. A glass sword. Get him! It worked! It worked! Now, we need to make another save. We'll save over test. And then does this dissipate after a minute? And what is this? That's his whole body. Look at that. You're dead, bro. You are dead. D-E-D, -D, dead. Oh, I have a berry. Let's eat that berry. Um, he's got two keys. Let's go ahead and grab those. And it looks like there is a room of goodies behind here. Um... I need this to dissipate so I can go get the team back. Is what we need. Go away. How long does this last for? Hopefully not too long. Um, let's put our... This fire wand back in our bag and get our sword back out. Obviously, there's all kinds of goodies up in the upper room, uh, in the room that is uh, kind of like up here. But I want my team back. I need this to dissipate. 
I need this to dissipate. Could I... Okay. I didn't get to choose how long I rested, but whatever. If you don't have someone to wake you up, do you just sleep forever? Uh-oh. Get up. This didn't dissipate. This is still here. How do I make this go? Oh, wait. Do I have, um... Hold on. Hold on. So I'll use one of these keys to open this. And then up here, we have all kinds of stuff. All kinds of stuff. We have Gauntlets of Quickness. It's the Sword Strike Scroll. Some Blood Moss. Some, oh, just Spider Silk. All kinds of reagents. We have the other orb. We have gems. We have locked chests, and I don't have any picks with me. So that's disconcerting. So I need picks. So I need one of my team back. Now I could step on this. Oh, wait, is this door open down here? Oh, it's gone. Okay, let's go get the team. Team, are you all still here alive? Aha! Good. Good, they're all here. Do pray. Join me. Goodbye. Shimino. Join me. Goodbye. YOLO! YOLO, quit! Oh, YOLO, you're the worst. Join me. Bye. Voiden, join me. All right. Now let's deal with this nonsense down here real quick. But I think... Actually, can I just walk away from them? Yeah, I can just walk away. All right. Well, that worked out well. We killed this guy, and now we got the team back with us. And we have got all kinds of goodies now. So, let's figure out what we have going on here first. Let's save. Now that we have figured out how to get the team back together. What do we have in here? Money? A magic set of armor? Oh, wow. Okay. And a whole bunch of stuff here, which is pretty, pretty solid, um, which I like a lot. Uh, so, let us, whoop, let's divvy up this, these spoils. Okay, this is a lot here. All right, so, Grug. He has a full suit of magic armor. What do the Gauntlets of Quickness do? Like, what do they do? I'm not, not sure. Uh, makes you faster. That's, yeah, they, yeah, they make you faster, but... Oh, it probably ups your dexterity. Okay. So, if we look at Grug right now, he's got a dex of 24. Who's got a really low dex? Dupre's at 24. Shimino, 27. 30. Probably you, right? Yeah, 12. So, Broyden is the one that needs that the most, but... Being that they're magic gauntlets, I bet you they probably don't weigh very much. So, oh, they probably weigh the same. 
Hey, look, yeah, I think they weigh zero. Yeah, yeah, let's put these on Dupre. Dupre, you may have the magic gauntlets. We have a sword strike, but we all a sword strike, a sword strike spell. Um, we though have we do have more reagents, so let's grab these whilst we are here. We have sword strike, which I don't think is a spell that we are. I don't know if we have that yet or not. Uh, let's see. No, we don't have Sword Strike. So, we will transcribe. Hopefully I've got all the, everything I need for this. Uh, transcribe. Sword Strike. There we go. Again, we have the orb here. We need to put that with the other orbs. So there is another orb. Boop. What is this? Arion's axe. So we have a magic throwing axe. Let's, I think you just have a regular magic axe, right? And... Yeah, I mean, you can fight hand-to-hand. -hand. I'm fine with that. Let's swap out this magic axe for this Arion's magic... Whoa! Whoa! Is that a throwing axe, though? Is that a throwing axe? I don't know. I don't know. Um. Let's see here. Uh, let's see here. Strong weapon. Oh, it cannot be thrown. Can't be thrown. It's just a melee weapon of awesomeness is what it is. Um, I'll tell you what. You have what? I think you need to stick with this whole goodness here. But I think we maybe give the axe to... You have a magic sword. You have a sword of defense. Why don't we do this? Why don't we put your sword in your pouch? And then let's give the axe to Dupre. That feels good. He can walk up and hit people with an axe. That's, I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, we got a couple gems here. So let's, uh, we really don't need them because of the false coin spell. We are now secret millionaires who will never run out of money. But we could always decorate our homes with these, I guess. Here, Broyden, you carry that gem for now. Here, Boyden, you carry all these extra gems. In here. Uh, I'm not worried about carrying that gold. That's a lot of weight. Um, we've got 100 magic bolts. We've got, is this another fire? Oh, that's a lightning wand. Let's see if we can put that in this extra bag here. There we go. A little bit of lightning wand action. Down with that. So now we have a full set. Well, almost a full set of magic armor. Just no magic boots, but since magic boots are a waste, who needs them? And you know, actually, I'm thinking... Let's do this. I'm going to give... I just... I feel better... The Avatar deserves this. And then let's... Yeah! Look at that. Oh! Okay, yeah! Let's do that. And then... Is there anybody not... Equipped? You have the Fire Sword. You have a Sword of Defense. These just extra Swords of Defense down here. Will these fit in this bag? Oh, too heavy. To pray. Why? Give him to the pack mule. Oh, that's that's the one Shimino's holding. 
I'm like, why is there an extra thing there? So we got a full set of magic armor. So that's the Helm of Monitor, the Helm of Courage. We don't want to give that up. Of course, we have our cloak. I think you're fully decked out. On to Dupre. And I think magic armor has like no weight, if I remember correctly. Which is what makes it so awesome. So actually, like, if we take off this breastplate... Oh, that's the one from the beginning of the game. Uh, let's take this off of you. Let's give you the breastplate. And let's give you the magic armor. Or do we give it to... You can wear plate armor, that's fine. You have magic gauntlets. You do not have magic gauntlets. You have regular gauntlets. Have some magic. Uh, you have regular chain leggings, have some metal leggings, you have our Helm of Light, you have a plumed helm, you can have the magic helm, and let's give, uh, let's give this helmet to our buddy here. That looks good. Oh, now we're starting to rock it out. We are starting to rock it out. Uh, let's see. Why don't you drop these leather leggings and have some real leggings? Beautiful. Beautiful. And I don't think we, we have some, need some arms for this guy, but we don't have any yet. This guy's got magic armor everywhere, right? Yeah, if we had more magic armor, that'd be great. But let's get some gauntlets on you so you're all decked out. Ooh, that, that was profitable. Again, this gold, if I have a, a sack of gold, I'm fine. I don't need extra gold. I have plenty of gold. Extra swords of defense. Plenty for what we need. Woo! All right, team, we are decked out. I tell you what, does this take us back to here? And we should have a key now? Look at that. Look at that, folks. Well, now we got to get out of here. Now we got to find our way back out of here. Oh, that just means we have to go up the way we came in. That's super easy. So we just go this way. In theory, we go this way. And let's go ahead and do a save before we walk up here. That should be pretty good. All right. Yes. Up we go. Up. Up, up we go. Oh, evil Spiderville. Okay, team, we need to run this way because I need to be in control of who we're fighting and when. The problem is is that we do this super slow and like just this let's take our time getting there team just take your time it's all good i mean actually i just don't want to fight any of them i could just go this way right like if i just don't go into combat mode until we get to these scorpions Why? Why was there... Who is wielding a weapon they're not supposed to have? Dupre. Dupre. No. Dupre, you can't be trusted, apparently. Why would you take that out of your pack? You dummy. You're equipped in a specific way for a specific reason. Can I put this in any of my packs? Yes. Apparently the avatar has to carry that. Dupre can't be trusted. 
we're gonna have to start when we can get back to monitor hopefully at some point we'll be able to uh uh restore that equipment again we were carrying so much with us i need to do some inventory management but we'll do that when we get to monitor if we ever get back there uh what's here oh little baby spider coming after us leave us alone We'll just pretend those guys don't exist. Like we did on the way down. No biggie. The scorpion will probably need dealt with though, but we can do that. Boom! All right. We are back up here. I tell you what. That's awesome. All right. Come down here. Come back out. So what that means is that we only have this last place to go. right down right down I said right on down I said I said uh, right on down here man Leghorn Foghorn you don't see him too often anymore uh, let's save and, you know let's just jump in to this area let's just go I don't know what's back here uh, let's see. I don't need this map anymore. Let me get the other map up. So, there's a plane flying over. Oh, no! A dead automaton. A body here with leather armor. A serpent sword. Do we need this serpent sword? I don't know if we do or not. We'll grab it just in case. I don't know if we need those. Uh oh. There we go. What do you have? Some coins. What is this? Oh, a blowgun. Arrows, and that's it. Okay. Oh, there's another Naga down here. Hello, lady. Ooh, some pastries. So we have golden automatons. I wonder if I can bring them back to life? with that, like, create automaton spell. Or it has to be the regular type. Hello. Ooh, some pumpkins. Anything down here? Uh oh, somebody had a bad time over there. Okay, nothing over here. Oh, we can probably talk to that wizard now. Um, there was that wizard lady who wouldn't teach us anything because we didn't have a spell book earlier. Hey, look, it's that that Naga spawned in. It's the worst thing in Ultima. Let's see. This guy has had a bad time. We're coming, we're coming. Oh, look, little snakes. Why are they all focusing on Boyd? Boyd, stop letting them focus you down. You're not allowed to die. 
Like, explicitly, you are not allowed to die. So, what's up with this guy? Nothing. His brains are leaking out everywhere. Which is probably not good. Probably has to do with why he's dead. A skeleton here, nothing on it. about up this way Ooh. I think this is the one like if we killed the lich then there must be this is the entrance that has the oh oh whoa this is a dangerous hallway I don't know what these things are Stuck again. Oh, good! I got stuck so they could spawn back in on me. What's happening here? I'm very confused. What do we have? Leather armor? Leather boots, do you need anything? No, back to battle. I'm gonna try and just walk Grug past whatever these weird worms are. And I'm just gonna try and get out of here so we can maybe rest. All right, ah, uh, no. Oh, there's all kinds of stuff around here to fight us. I shan't be able to rest, I think, here. We'll find out. Let's see. Am I able to sleep? Do you think we'll die? What do you think will happen? I don't know. Okay, that's not bad. He's got enough hit points that we're not about to just die immediately. So let's grab our pack. Looks like we've got a leather helm. Let's save now that we're down here. And let's take a look at what we have going on. So over here, here's where we are. It looks like there's something red and scary here. Some possible treasure chest in this area. Uh, it looks like, oh, it's got a maze. Okay, so there's a staircase here and a staircase here. Um, and obviously they go to these two little staircase areas. And one of those is going to go over to here. And this is going to go over to here. Which looks to be like a dead end, but it might be full of good things. I bet you we have to get up here. Whoop. Whoop. Rup. Where did, where did my, where did my, my map go? Map, why you go away? Why you go away, map? Map? There we go. See all my beautiful windows there. So, obviously we have to get up to here. Which I think just means going across the top, right? Like, if I just ignore all of this and just go across the top, let's let's try just going. Let's just do it. See if my guess is correct. Lots of bodies with nothing on them. A couple headless ones chasing us down. Like, that's not much to be afraid of. Oh, magic field. That's a spiked shield, isn't it? No, it's a buckler. Just don't walk in the magic field. Okay, yeah, let's go this way and see if... Oh, no! Do you see that? 
that was just poopy. That was just the worst. Um, if I can get here through here without anybody dying, we just, you have to keep running. Okay, we're all alive. This goes down here. This is a little room we can sleep in. Up here. Okay, yes. So that's where we want to go. So let's try. Is there enough room for the bedroll? Like, that's the problem. Um, look, is there enough room right up here? Obviously, that's where we have to go. Obviously. Okay. Why did we not heal hardly at all? I don't know. We'll keep traveling. And we'll see what happens. Oh. Okay. Again, just there's traps in these hallways. They're not good for us. Not healthy at all. Stone harpies over there. Am I going the right way? Yeah, it says to loop around. I'm worried that we're going to take more random damage. Don't know. Uh, let's do a random save in the weird room spot. Okay. Yep, yep, that's what I thought was going to happen. I knew there'd be something. I knew there was something wacky going on here. So what happens if we slowly... It's just bad. It's just bad times. Um... Huh. Hmm. Let's see here. Is this the right one for solo mode? Nope. Not sure what any of that does. Huh. Well, we know what we have to deal with, which is to get through this unfortunate big mess here. So we might have to rest again. Uh, in fact, like it actually doesn't do that much damage all the time. I just don't know why we're not getting a lot of healing from our resting. There we go. That time we did. Weird that we didn't before. All right. Let's try again. Here we go. Ugh. Shimino. Um, can I... I can't use the hourglass here. Okay. So... This... If I can get the teams... I just don't want to have to do the, like, everybody leave and then... Like, is there no way to trigger a trap? Unless I walk? Like, it's not like I can see a pressure plate or anything. Like, if I take an item... That doesn't do anything. Is there a spell? 
There is a spell, isn't there? Um, destroy trap. Hold on, detect trap. Aha! One there, one there, and there. Okay. Do you think there are any more? Do you think there are any more? No, we're good. Ah, oh, there wasn't even one there. Come on, team. You need to figure out how to manage and get around walls. All right. What is going on up here? You know what? We're at 40 minutes. And um, I don't want to get in a conversation with somebody. It's going to take a long time if we are not have time to go through it. So we'll break off here. And on the next episode, we'll talk to this strange man who is up here in the uh, top section of this area. Until then, I'm going to say thanks for watching. Please tell your friends. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe. And as always, we hope to see you soon.